Welcome back to Mad Cardigan. Hey, dog meat. How you doing, buddy? And our continuing playthrough of Clear the Map in Fallout 4. Got my trusty laser rifle. Let's get this going again. I think I'm hunting ghouls this time. I'm ghoul crazy. I'm doing all this for that asshole Reese. Just to prove myself, I guess. But we all know the real reason I'm doing it. I'm doing it for the XP. Ooh, these ghouls tanking a shot there. I guess that wasn't a sneak. Really got to get my silenced weapons going. Okay, I can see him. little fact, I'm sure most of you know this, but if you go into VATS and aim at the center torso, whenever you come out of VATS, it uh, pretty much has you up a centered shot. I don't always trust myself with my aim down sights, so I'll use that every once in a while. You'll see me hopping in and out of VATS. Pro tip. Buy a non-pro. Is that wall going to block me? Three times. Nope. Skated it over. I'm lucky for him. Okay, still have a couple dots. Maybe three. You guys are all infesting these buildings around here. Ooh, nailed him. Gotta make sure I get these sneak shots to, to get that one shot kill. Oh, he saw me. Thought they did laser weapons really well in this game. All the energy weapons, actually, the even the laser shots have a little bit of bump to them. You know, a lot of times they're kind of pew pew. Where's this guy? It says he's on the ground floor. Didn't say he's above. Oh, yeah, he is. He's up a flight. I should have had an arrow above him. Those are trying to trick me. Eat it. The jiggly dance. There you go, ragdoll. Living in a movie. And y'all like Aerosmith? Steven Tyler, he's got the biggest mouth in history. Good for singing though. hope my voice has finally cleared up from being sick. It feels normal, but I don't know if it sounds normal. A little looped. Pocketed. Always a decent thing. No money. Set pieces that go on, on a stick caused her to end it all. Don't blame her. Always check the mail. Ooh, hold up. Almost got me. Always check those mailboxes. Good places for uh, explosives sometimes. I'm really wanting to see some of this new content. I want to see a new weapon or something. I'm not exactly sure what all it encompasses. Let's take that. Ooh, yeah. not far enough. I need that throwing arc real bad. Next level of demolitions or explosives or whatever it's called. Whoa, crap. Oh. You turd. We came out of fast. He was waiting at the door. You're on fire, partner. Stinks in here. Always 
is go for a suitcase. Might give me a little toot toot sailor's hat. Sea captain, I like that one too. idiot savant. We get to start hitting on the on the quests though. That was rich ghoul. These guys didn't fare so well in here. I just finished watching the, the series for the second time, the new Fallout TV series. I recommend it if you're a Fallout fan. Got a lot of whodunit in it, but that's Vault Tech for you. Never know what the hell's going on with those guys. I'm already ready for the second season. Got so spoiled. I know most of you guys don't remember what it was like before cable TV and all that, where you had to watch an episode and then wait a week for another episode to come out. Cliffhangers really meant something at that time. But now, you get to watch a whole series and, and instead of you know, next week the new series starts. No, now it's got to wait a year. <clears throat> okay, I see one, but I know you ain't one. Trust my own name. All right, that's not bad. All right, barbecue time. Barbie G. Where's your buddy? They are not fast around stairs. He's like, oh, I'm thinking about it. Hopefully this is an escalator. Nope, damn it, it's just stairs again. What's going on, Bob? Stuck down in the subway tunnel for a couple hundred years. And they're suffering here. I'm a humanitarian, actually. Oop, I always take the drugs. Very valuable. Still haven't decided whether I want to use my ill-gotten gains for buying legendaries or not. Some of those things are so overpowered. I don't know if I want to do that or, or just wait and see naturally what kind of legendaries I get. And yeah, we'll see how it goes along. If, I don't want to get too overpowered. Just, you know how Bethesda is. They can, they can really... Oh. Take a chance with that dude. I start shooting in here and the floor lights on fire. Yeah, pretty quick you can get so powerful that the game is just, nothing scares you anymore. I don't want to get to that point, you know. If, I'll ramp up the difficulty if, you know, if I feel like that's that's happening. But a lot of those guns and stuff you can buy really do, you know, there's, there's a couple in particular. You know, I'll, uh, can you remember that vendor's name, that crazy chick? You, you, you all know what I'm talking about. But if I naturally get some kind of crazy good legendary weapon, you can be damn sure I'm going to use it. Let's get the hell out of here. You can clear this whole thing. This subway station is like multiple levels, and there's more raiders camping out down there. I just took care of their ghoul problem for them. They ought to pay me for that. But getting raiders to pay for anything is a pain in the ass. Sneaky and get my butt back to the police station. All right, Reese, cough up that XP, man. Dance just loves that that bar area right there. Stays there all the time. Where are you? Okay. Was this always? I know this was well, normally dark. Did they add a lamp, or Take is that area's clear? No, I think I do remember this. Every time up, I see something I that I don't immediately remember, I start guts. thinking it's yeah. part of the new update. Yeah. Like they updated and put lamps around. You, you know, ready for so stupid. Run. Oh you know, yeah, I got the uh, idiot swan on a quest. Six hundred and eighteen for that. Nice. What do you think, dog meat? Good box. I don't remember that being there either.
Maybe I'm crazy. But hey, it seems new to me, so that makes it fun. What do we got? Always spend your levels, kids. I'll go two and three times. If I am get leveled up in the middle of something, you completely forget about it. What are we looking at? Nothing new popping up. Ah, you know what? Let's get towards that throwing arc so I don't burn myself to death. Paladin. Welcome back. I've got another mission for you, if you're ready. You sound like Preston. Ready. Outstanding. Over the years, the Brotherhood has sent several recon teams to the Commonwealth. Well, good the for last the Brotherhood. squad went in three years ago. They never reported back. Officially, they're missing. Presumed dead. And you and that power armor can't do anything about it, I'm huh? I'm sorry. Don't be. Everyone who signs up for a recon mission knows what to expect. Our lives depend on our training and on each other. And if we should fall, the Brotherhood will honor our memory. We have a responsibility to find out what happened to them, if we can. All right. I'll see to it. Their insertion point was in the hills near Malden. Survey the area and establish a search pattern. Monitor your radio for distress signals. All recon teams are issued distress pulsers that put out a short-range homing beacon. If you can acquire a signal, you should be able to trace it to its source. Sounds simple enough, but I'm not going to do it right now. You're trying to send me north, and uh, north is bad in this game. Okay, what are we looking at here? We need more levels. I want to be ready for whatever this game throws at me. Super Duper Mark. All right. Mm. It's kind of backtracking a little bit. All my best stuff is on. Mining helmet will give you a couple points of armor, a little bit more. Look like a working man, like one of the village people. I'm sure, if they reinvented the village people today one of them would be a vault dweller uh, which way do we want to go there's a couple different ways you can go here I'm going to go the way I normally don't go just put it that way I know there's usually like a, a random event on this road it's like a usually a trader or a weird stranger walking around it's always interesting to see you can play the same area over and over and over again and it'll give you something different every time hopefully it's another trader I can just get a little bit more money from them might start selling some of these stem packs not uh, don't need hundreds of them hopefully say that oh well you're not a trader oh crap and the incredibly exciting pack of dogs oh shit you got buddies okay okay I don't know if I have the action points for all of you. Oh, that was fantastic. Missed 283 shots. Come on, dog meat. Get to work. God, man. Okay, there is a pack of you. Oh, crap. And he's on the move, too, so... Oh. Come on. There he is. Doing fantastic dog meat. I know they were friends of yours, but come on, man. Loyalty. People before dogs or bros before hoes or whatever the hell you say. Not that I'm a bro. I don't consider myself that. Oh, 
It can scare you. It can sneak up on you when you're wearing headphones, especially. There needs to be an option of turning down the idiot savant laugh. Or the PC way that John from Miniature Nerd says, idio savant. Hell, he might be right. Okay, let's go ahead and cross the bridge. You can get uh, a perk that will let you swim and not take any rads from it, which in survival mode is extremely helpful. You can travel the waterways here. Too bad we're not playing in Venice. But uh, this is another small dungeon, but it's got a guy in power armor in it, so don't know if I want to piss him off right now. We may have to come back and get him later. I don't remember if there's anything good in that this little uh, fight. I'm not one of those guys that has, you know, everything memorized where all the bobbleheads are. I know where some are, you know, but I'm not an encyclopedia of this game. Keep checking. I always hit that VATS button. If you hear the click, you're clear. Duck every once in a while to make sure you're hidden. This shit will sneak up on you. Oh, dog, you found an enemy. Did the gunfire give it away? Oh, no, you're trying to go to Hangman's Alley. I'm not even interested in that right now. Also, if you're playing um, survival mode and you need a central location, Hangman's Alley, which I just passed it on the right, it's in that alley right there, is probably the most central um, area in this game, central settlement that you can colonize, and you're right next to Diamond City here for traders and all that kind of stuff because you don't have fast travel, so very convenient. Oh, I see some legendaries popping up in here. Oh my gosh, these guys are tough. Ooh, thank God I'm not fighting this on my own. Got down to be secure. That was fantastic. I'm not having good luck with bats. Down in city, they're pretty tough guys. Got all that baseball gear on. Catcher's chest plate and all that. Okay, you're not. It's just telling me I can shoot him through cover. It's like 66% through cover. That is not true, I don't believe. And that popped to zero. So I do this manually. Wow. That was tough. Oh, there's a legendary. Okay. First legendary. What can I do to him? Yeah, he went to zero. These guys are taking a little beating here. Might have to leave the old mad cardigan. That is upsetting me. It's telling me to shoot for cover. There are some perks I'll take later on that allow you to shoot through cover, but yeah, see, that's not working. Alright, time to get the explosives going. Eat it. Everybody catch on fire. BBM. Okay, I think he's coming out of cover. Wow. Boy, they tanked this stuff thing real well. Take a couple shots at him. Get him mutating or whatever that's called when they refill their life and get them down to half. Ooh, look at that, man. He just sat there and took it. One thing about good thing about super mutants, they are large targets. Come on, is that actually you can't tell if there's something in front of him or not. Is this new? Is this uh, seeing through cover new? Damn. Damn is right. Of mutants, huh? You're our kind of guy. I know. Can I have some of that the gear? City? Just follow the signs. I know where it is. I've been here. Okay. Okay, there's the... Okay, and yielding. Not bad. I don't plan to be below 25% health, but it does happen from time to time. Oh, two legendary. Wow. That's unusual. We're just three mutants and two of them are legendary. I'll take it. All right. First couple pieces of legendary gear. There's a chest up here somewhere. Is that it? No, that's a set piece. Oh, there it is. 
Dude, dude. An actual hunting rifle? Okay. I need the suppressor for that before I start using it. Okay, okay. Not bad dog meat. Nothing for you, buddy. No more teddy bears. I need to get him some more teddy bears. I'm going to load him up. I have four dogs myself, and they disassemble toys within days, so he can't just have one teddy bear. He's going to have that thing ripped up quick. Okay, look at me. Rocking legendary gear. Okay, okay. It's kind of dark, can't really see it. Still look like a weird village person, but... Kind of getting tired of this vault suit. I know it gives you a little extra protection, but I like to customize my look a little bit. I have to find a good set of clothes. One that lets you put armor over all of them. Oh, beloved Piper. Can't open the gate. And we're going into safe area, so it's time to put on the my Stop dapper clothing. Around, Danny. I'm standing out in the open yes, I am the foreman. That's why I'm dressed like I this. I got orders not to let you in, Miss Piper. I'm sorry. I'm just doing my job. Ooh, just doing your job. Protecting Diamond City means keeping me out, is that it? <laughs> oh, look, it's the scary reporter. Boom. I'm sorry. But Mayor McDonough's really steamed, Piper. Saying that article you wrote was all lies. The whole city's in a tizzy. Tizzy? Nice word. Ugh! You open this gate right now, Danny Sullivan. Piper's mad. I live here. You can't just lock me out. <sighs> you. You want into Diamond City, right? I just got here, but yeah. Shh. You look very damp, lady. What? What's that? The water effects you are going nuts in this one. You up from Quincy? Do you have enough supplies to keep the general store stocked for a whole month? <laughs> you hear that, Danny? You gonna open the gate and let us in, or are you gonna be the one talking to crazy Myrna about losing out on all the supply? Jeez, all right. I need to make it personal, Piper. Give me a minute. Better head inside quick before old Danny catches on to the bluff. Sounds good. Let's go. Let's do it. Another great day in Diamond City. Piper, who let you back inside? I told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. You devious, rabble-rousing slanderer. The level of dishonesty in that paper of yours. I'll have that Ooh, printer that scrapped for parts. Mr. McDonough? Tyrant mayor shuts down the press. Rabble-rousing slanderer. Why don't we ask the newcomer? You support the news? Because the mayor's threatened to throw free speech in the dumpster. They don't have newspapers anymore. we got websites. This really isn't any of my business. Oh, I... Didn't mean to bring you into this argument, good sir. No, no, no. You look like Diamond oh, yeah. City I'm material. Just a wandering architect. Welcome to the great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Wearing my hard hat. Safe in my suit. Happy. A fine place to come. Spend your money. Settle down. Don't let this muckraker here tell you otherwise. Muckraker, right? you watch your mouth, buddy. I'm sure your city's a great place. <laughs> yeah, greatest house of cards in the Commonwealth. Until the wind blows. <laughs> now, was there anything particular you came to our city stick. for? I'm trying to find someone. Trying to find someone? Who? Elvis. My I'm son, Sean. He's less than a year old. Wait, your son's missing? Oh, you hear that, McDonough? What's Diamond City Security doing to help this man, huh? This isn't the first missing persons report to come through here, and now we have an infant who's been taken? Uh, don't listen to her. Well, I'm afraid that our security team can't follow every case that comes through. I'm confident that you can find help here. 
Diamond City has every conceivable service known to man. One of our great citizens can surely find the time to help you. Well, sure. And a mayor of a great a city kiss so never everyone. hurt. Who can help me? Oh, I'm sorry, oh, I don't have time for any more. I'm wearing this architect suit for this. I'm a busy then. man. Enjoy your stay in our fair city. This is ridiculous. Diamond City Security can't spare one officer to help. I want the truth, McDonough. What's the real you can't reason handle the truth. I've had enough of this, Piper. From now on, consider you and that little sister of yours on notice. Yeah, keep talking, McDonough. That's all you're good for. <laughs> Her rump. Mm, a big Diamond City welcome from the mayor. You feel honored yet? Look, I gotta go get settled in, but, um, stop by my office later. I have an idea for an article you'd be perfect for. You need to go dry off first. Leather coat's ruined. All right, I'm in city. Boston Favorite Baseball Stadium. Quite a show, huh? Quite a show. Hate it when they bring up the Institute. Ain't like folks aren't already scared of them. Anyway, don't let it get to you. Life here is still a hell of a lot safer than out there in the Commonwealth. I know, it's when we're in the suit. I'll be fine. Thanks. Welcome. So what brings you to the great green jewel? Elvis. I'm just kidding. Looking for someone who's gone missing. Gone missing? Who is it? Friend? Relative? My son was kidnapped. His name is Sean. Your boy's gone missing? That's terrible. Mm -hmm. I'm afraid missing people don't get found in Diamond City. God seems to have turned a blind eye to them. And with all the fear of the Institute in people's hearts, they've turned a blind eye as well. All right, speech him up. I'm lost, Pastor. I need help. Please. Well, now I don't want to get your hopes up, but there is someone who might be able to help. Nick Valentine. He's a detective. Saved a lot of lives over the years, but so many more stay missing. And trouble has a habit of sticking to him. Sounds like my kind of guy. Thanks. I'll go talk to him. Everything I need sticks to you. Now. Piper, you're back. Still have super mutant on my shoes. Hey, kiddo. How are the paper sales? Well, the presses are getting overloaded. That motor is going to go soon if we don't replace it. Dog meat's taking a look for you. Now, you've been saying that for weeks and the old girl still keeps cranking. Stop worrying so What do you much. think, dog meat? Can you fix it? I gotta head into the office. You start whistling if you see any angry politicians coming our way. Why? Is something wrong? Nope, it's a lost cause. Piper? <sighs> Free paper to newcomers. If the Institute grabs you in the night, at least we warned you. Thanks, I guess. I'm serious. The Institute takes people. You should read up if you're sticking around. Yeah, I'll believe, I believe you. you. Thanks. You are a real lost lamb in the wolf's den, mister. Is the dog yeah! Oh. Oh, again. Anyone is one of those things. It's that secretary of his... Her Listen to all the local town gossip. Hair. Mm -hmm. Many times I've played this game, I don't think I've ever heard uh, everything that everyone myself, has to say in this place. That's just it, Johnny. You wouldn't be able to tell the difference. If you nick like mom's on the sauce. Your razor, he'd bleed. Don't mean nothing. Hmm. Around here, we call your haircut the scav special. We call Little yours the dipshit. Maybe. We got small arms, long arms, ammunition. Sometimes you gotta wonder, does anyone fight back? 
Institute has to have enemies, right? What? You mean the railroad? Well, that's a fairy tale. Told you your luck wouldn't last forever. Oh, okay. His a new mission. Oh, Nick. Something wrong? Another stray coming in from the rain. Afraid you're too late. Office is closed. Come on, speech check. I know you must be busy, but I won't take much of your time, miss. It's important. You're right. I'm sorry. All right. I didn't mean to be rude, but it's just... The detective... He's gone missing. Not very good at his job, huh? Don't worry. I can help. Tell me what happened. <sighs> Nick was working a case. Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman, and he tracked them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there that they use as a base. I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but... He just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. It's kind of mercenary, but yeah, I'll find just you. You have my be word. nice. Thank you. Nick should be it. easy to spot. <laughs> He's always wearing that old hat and these trench coat help after all. Please hurry. <laughs> oh yeah. Nice. It was nice to get those little hundred and fifty quest, you know, knocked up like that. Boom, now it's five times. Idiot Savant is even better now. Okay. So thirsty. Good old Sheffield. Doctor says I Resident can't drink liquor no more. Cola. Need a new Coca Cola. Hey Sheffield. Thirsty. New Coca Cola. That's why I keep one on Here hand. Ah, <gasps> oh, thank you, thank you. Just like the guy who wants water at the beginning of Fallout Three. Hey Sheffield, what do you think about coming to work for me? Really? You. You mean it? Yeah, Mama Murphy could use That's a right. squeeze. You don't look like you could put up much of a fight. Okay, I'll, I'll do it. All right. Put on something nicer, though. Don't Ooh. move, Sim. What have you done with the right behind me. Where's my brother? I swear, I'm not a Sim. Don't shoot, for God's sake. At least sake, do the rest too. Put the gun down now. He's a Sith. He'll kill us all. All right then. Kyle, you warned you. No! Okay, show's over. There are no synths in Diamond City. Hear me? Just you folks and your damn paranoia. Officer, I need you to step away, Scaver. I understand, officer. I just want to know I'm what. I'm a curious architect. What you didn't hear the shouting? Guy pulls a gun on his own brother, thinking he's a synth. It's that newspaper's fault. Got people all riled up, thinking their own family might be replaced by machines. Look, I'm sorry you got caught up in all this, but it's over, okay? Just go about your business like nothing happened. Better that way. All right, Johnny Bench, thank you. Oh, newsboy cap. That's a charisma hat. Can uh, hey. complete What's my outfit. Still standing around for? He pulled a gun on me. Go back to your own damn business. My own brother. Is this guy a synth? You're safe now. That's all that matters. I'm. I'm not a synth. I, all right, Riley. I told him. I, I kept telling him. Be keeping an eye on you. To me. The only way you know I, uh, is to kill the guy. See if he's got a synth component on him. I need a minute. But I'm not interested in fighting all of Diamond City right now. Move along. Moving. Nothing to see here. Let's go finish Piper's little little XP quest. Maybe I'll get lucky and get the uh, idiot savant for this one too. I'm glad you dropped by. You holding up, Blue? I am red. My favorite ballpark's become a shanty town. So today's been great. Interesting Love sarcasm. You mentioning that, seeing as you're from a vault. Yeah. You're not wearing the blue jumpsuit right now, but the Pip-Boy and that fish-out-of-water look? Dead giveaways. 
So you so drive your coat deal. off. That's good. I want an interview. Your life story in print. I think it's time Diamond City had a little outside perspective on the Commonwealth. You do that, and uh, I'll tell you what. I'll come with you. Watch your back while you get used to the no world thanks, above ground. No thanks, I'll take the XP. All right, Piper. I'm in. Good. Let's get down to business. So, I know you're from a vault. How would you describe your time on the inside? It was just me and a thousand guinea pigs. They turned carnivorous. Okay. I guess we're going to have to go with the satirical approach to this art. Satire? Have so you seen some of guinea pigs running around up here? Diamond City. How does it compare to your old life? You're all living in rusty shacks, killing each other. Oh my god, the smell. Okay. Well, that's going to be a fun one to quote. You're welcome. Now, I already know you're looking for your son, Sean. Do you suspect the Institute was involved in his kidnapping? A man took Sean, not some shadowy group. I hope that's true. Because I don't know at this point. Because if they are involved, everything no, Jason Statham took him, that's for all I know. For the last part of our interview, I'd like to do something different. I want you to make a statement to Diamond City directly. The threat of kidnapping is all but ignored in the Commonwealth. Everyone wants to pretend it just doesn't happen. What would you say to someone out there who's lost a loved one but might be too scared or too numb to the world to look for them? The old standby. Find who's responsible and make them pay. Simple as that. I'll take anger. I could be over altruistic, but day. I know how this is going to end, quote. so I'm going to get my damn Thanks, revenge. Quote. That's everything. They don't really it's give you a take choice. Some time to put this all together, but I think your story is going to give Diamond City plenty to talk about. Anyway, I agreed to come with you, right? Watch your back. Just say the word when you're ready. I can't wait to see where the story goes next. Oh well, can't get idiot Solante every time. I think now she lets you take everything from her well, if apartment. Anyone could figure out a good use for uh, it. That's true. Okay, got all the XP I can for the moment. Getting Piper to go with you sometimes, you know, if you do a like a the companion quests and all that. They do have some perks that are pretty decent. Hers Excuse will me. give you, you double then. XP for like discovering genuine, authentic, um, places and all that. And, and you do discover a lot of places. So it is pretty useful, but it takes a lot sure. to get her to, take a look. <laughs> to like you. History. There are mods right that ahead. help, but I don't, like I said, I'm not playing with any mods today or this the, for this playthrough. So I wish I needed a melee weapon. That Rockville Slugger is not too bad. I really don't need anything this guy has. We'll take his money, though. Here, bat salesmen have a bunch of bullets. I know you're a closet gun user. You can have that bat over your shoulder all you want. You're not fooling anybody. Hey, Mo. Now, don't be shy. You're never too old to own a SWAT. Got any work? Well, if you want to help the sport. I got a lead on a stash of pre-war collector's items. Coach, quitting his for punks Weston, had an estate not too far from here. Legend says when he retired, the league presented him with a baseball, catcher's mitt, and playing card signed by all the other coaches. See where I'm going with this? I'll pay 100 caps each for those relics, what do you say? Uh, let's do it. A hundred caps seems light. I need more. You that think you can play me for a sucker? One hundred caps a piece, and that's it. Take it a leave. Fine. You drive a hard a bar card a mitt and a ball. Got it. I thank you. And baseball thanks you. Not sure that's baseball. But whatever, man. Hey, you're the new guy, right? Arturo, what's going on? Yeah. You're my kind of guy. You're guy. a gun guy. Well, it's good to have you here. Name's Arturo Rodriguez. If you need protection, let's talk. I'll take a look. Okay. Sure. Don't forget to stock up on ammo. Yeah, don't worry about that. 
Ooh, big boy. That is a powerful gun, but it's also dangerous to yourself. <laughs> you got to be out of the blast radius. There's some bosses it's very handy for, though, so. Okay, while I'm sifting through inventory here, we'll go ahead and call this a part. And uh, I will go ahead and see you in the next episode. Thank you for joining me on Mad Cardigan.